What's up, Titans? This is Mr. Sturtz. Uh, we're on Lesson 5.4, Solving Special Systems of Linear Equations. Okay, now think back to Section 5.1 when we graphed to find solutions. Remember, the solution of a graph is where the two lines intersect. So in this section, we're going to focus on a few special solutions to these systems. Okay, this first one here where it says one solution... Where the two lines intersect, that ordered pair was our answer. Okay, so maybe this was, I don't know, negative 2, 2. Okay, that could be our solution. There's one solution, that's our answer, that ordered pair. This middle one, if we have two lines that are parallel, remember parallel lines never intersect, so we're not ever going to get a solution. Those two lines go on forever, they never intersect, we get no solution. Our third and final special case is if we have the same exact line. If that line, we think about where that line intersects, two lines on top of each other, they, they intersect at every single point on that line. And lines go on in each direction forever, so we're going to have infinitely many solutions. If you run into something like oh, y equals 3x plus 5, and the second one you get y equals 3x plus 5, if you graph that, you know those lines are going to fall directly on top of each other. If that's the case, we have infinitely many solutions. All right, let's try one here. Solve this system. We're going to use by graphing here. So this first one, 1 is our y-intercept, so we're going to plot a point on 1. We're going to go up to right 1, up to right 1. Our slope right here is 2. And we have this line right here through the points. And the second line, negative 5 of our y-intercept, so we're going down 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, plot a point. Our slope again is 2, up 2, right 1, up 2, right 1, up 2, right 1. Okay, notice these lines, if we were to draw our line through the points, these lines are parallel. Another way we can see that our lines are parallel, they have the same slope. Parallel lines never intersect, so we are going to have no solution. Those lines never intersect. Some of you can look at those equations and tell right away that they're parallel, because we have the same slope, we just need to make sure our y-intercepts are different. If the y-intercepts were the same, those would be the same exact line. So we would have infinitely many solutions. All right, let's go on to this one. Again, we're going to graph it. Uh, we need to solve this system. Um, let's see, we need to get y by itself. So let's work with that first equation here. So y equals, we're going to move our 2x to the other side, add 2x. When we do that, we're left with 2x plus 3. That's our first equation. Now let's rewrite our second one. I'm going to rewrite it down here. Negative 4x plus 2y equals 6. Okay, if we were to rewrite this, get it in y equals mx plus b, we have to add 4x first. So we're left with 2y equals 4x plus 6. Get y by itself. Divide by 2 on everything. So we're left with y equals 2x plus 3. Okay, look at these two lines. This equation and this equation are the exact same. So what we just talked about was if we were to graph these, 1, 2, 3, up to right 1, you really don't even need to graph these. Hopefully we can tell right away that those are going to be the same exact line. They lie right on top of each other. They're the same equation. So when we get that, we have infinitely many solutions. Okay, infinitely many solutions. Same line, infinitely many solutions. Parallel lines that never intersect, no solution.